<laughs> what up, guys? We got Nadine Gray's box here. This is a mystery box from Retail Regulators. Uh, I just checked. We have three to open. So if you bought one today, your box would be open tomorrow night. Uh, if we get overstocked, I can start popping three a day, um, except on Wednesdays and Thursdays, because me and Seth got the swap meet. But uh, other than that, let's get into this. Uh, sounds like that new undelivered mail is coming, guys. Uh, and uh, you can go crazy on that, especially when that new load comes in. We'll be popping. I'll, I'll open three, four a day. I'll hire margarita and everybody from the old school to come in and open boxes uh so you'll get a lot of box openings uh on the new stuff just keep them cranking because we have to sell twice as many as usual just to break even because they are double literally that load is double the price um but it's so exciting you know what i mean like everything you have no clue what you're opening <laughs> for this box oh this box was like Twice as heavy as it should be, too, FYI. Okay. Love Diana. So Hi, Linda. Hi, Laura. Hi, Anna. Diana Jordan says, get her done. These are heavy. These are heavy. Those horn sirens, those things are super <coughs> heavy. Excuse me. All right. Three, Lin four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Linda Linder says, 12, you never know 15, what 14, you 15, are 15, getting, 17, going to get. Remember, guys, if you like what you see, don't forget to like, comment, regulate the video, regulate your groups, regulate your pages, regulate, 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 and subscribe. 28 pieces, and I believe this is the $200 bullhorn. X5. Yep. So this is the exact same one I hooked up in my car. Uh, this is completely wireless. Uh, it does come with a... Uh, Cigarette adapter with a charger and the cable. Plug that into your cigarette lighter, and then you plug it into here. This has an internal battery, a lithium battery you could charge. And once it's charged, you don't have to have it plugged in. And then this little thing attaches to your car, so you can grab the siren and talk from where you are. You can hit the buttons. I played with mine. They're amazing. Uh, and the sirens are bulletproof, literally, guys. This is... Uh, oh, and it has way more features than I hooked up. I didn't hook up the flashing lights or nothing. But I believe this is the real thing they use for like emergency vehicles. I believe this is the kit they buy for those vehicles because it does the do, 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 do. flashing lights uh, uh, mm. Very. sequence, the sequence flashing lights. Very does cool. It all. Yeah. Super Caroline Fielder item. says, good afternoon, guys. Kim says, happy Saturday, everyone. Phil says, hey, all. Hope everyone is doing great. Kim says, that's pretty cool to get in trouble with, lol. I don't know. I mean, don't use this. Be I smart, don't people. The sirens, I don't think the sirens are illegal. I think it's red and blue lights. I think that's what's illegal. That you can't have. You can't have flashing red and blue oh, lights. Oh, Carrie Lynn. But I think Howdy you can Cindy. have flashing lights. This thing is pretty cool. It's made of wood, and it's a charging dock station. Ah. And it looks like it's the whole damn dock. Made of wood. Is it a CB radio, asked Phyllis? Yeah, very similar. Okay, then you got your charger in here. And it looks like it does a tablet, three phones, the watch, and the ear pods all at once. Uh-huh. Like you can see on the side that it has like six USB ports on the side. Really, holy cow. I don't know. Oh, I see. So you just plug it in here and then plug it into your device. Yes, yes. So it's not wireless. No. But it's just a super nice looking thing to put on your right. bed stand. Hi, Sally. Hi, Kim. Everybody says I could use that. Very organized. Uh, that would be my watch. Carrie, Li <laughs> Carrie Lynn says, hey, hey. D uh, dude, it's been a minute. Jason is losing weight. Oh, yeah. Let's check. Oh, boy. <laughs> Let me get the scale out. How much do I weigh, guys? Let's get those guesses going. Ugh. So we started this party at 250. Oh. Mm. Yee! Getting down there, boys. Getting down there. <laughs> uh. Some say 208, 208, 222. Uh, 213, 204. Never. 
182 season AD. I wish. I think that's the cutoff point right there. 182 is going to definitely be the cutoff point. So you got to plug this thing in too? Oh yeah, you plug it in one time and it charges all the things. Yeah, for it provides the electricity. That's cool. That's Super I'm not nice. seeing anything Remind me to moving. steal one of these for my room, bro. Okay. Remind me to steal. If there's any left, I don't think there was a lot of those. Oh. I think there's probably only a few of those. Phil says, way to go, Jason. Looking good. Linda Linder says, that's fantastic Fantastic news. Well, I, Cindy. Uh, it's, been, it's been rough for a couple of weeks, but uh, between yesterday and today, I kind of felt lighter, so I knew I was going to be a couple pounds under. And we have wireless TF card MP3 plane headphones. Very so cool. You can plug your card into there and just listen to the music off the card, too. You don't yeah. Have to Bluetooth it. This is Nadine Gray's box, Sally. Linda Linder says, what are your thoughts do, uh, doing to lose weight? What's that? Uh, what are your thoughts doing to lose weight, says Linda Linder. Well, ask Linda Linder. Uh, um, yes, Nadine, this is one of your boxes. One of your boxes. So I, everybody says I cheated. I used Ozempic. Uh, Cheater. It works fabulously, uh, as you can see. Um, soon, oh, now you have all the USBs to go with <laughs> every charger on that port. That's cool. There's uh, there's four chargers on each on each side. So you have eight plugs, and I think you have five plugs in here. Kim so you, says you're getting too skinny already. A little bit more, guys. A little bit more. I gotta get. Doctor said 170 was healthy for me. Put up on the register. Phil says, can't find any, any to use with hearing aids. Sure, wish I could, says Phyllis. Couldn't find any to use with hearing aids. This aid. looks cool. Okay. Funny blocks. Oh. So you build it. It's like the old, it's Legos, but it's like the old mousetrap. Right. So you start the marble out, and the marble rolls down the thing, assumably. Uh-huh. Does it go back up by itself, too? Morning, Kim. Uh, Linda says, my daughter is on Ozempic. She is not losing too much. I'm just start, I just started Mongiorno. Mongiorno is the other one. I'm not on Ozempic. I started on Ozempic, then they changed me to Wachovi. Uh, Ozempic, honestly, I think Ozempic was the best. Uh, Ozempic is very psychological. Uh, I didn't want to eat when I did the Ozempic for five weeks. Uh, and then uh, Ozempic allows you to control the amount of the uh, mes medicine independently because it's adjustable on the on the needle itself. And you use the you use the uh, same same one like five six times because they put extra into the into the very pretty. They put extra in the syringe. <laughs> Beth says my M M&M and M diet isn't working. I've done a lot of diets, bro. And the thing that messed me up... Uh, no, Phyllis, he does not have diabetes. N no no diet ever worked for me for my entire like youth. Uh, any of that, I could never lose weight uh, other than on drugs. That worked great. <laughs> uh, then when I got off drugs, I couldn't lose weight for the life of me, bro. I got up to like 230, 250, and I couldn't, I couldn't shake it for the life of me. So uh, then Annalisa comes in with the, the Adkins diet. And uh, that worked. That worked really well because you could eat as much meat as you want to. Meat, potatoes, steak, eggs. As uh, long as they have protein. No potatoes. No potatoes. Excuse me. Nothing yeah. white. You can't eat anything white. Um, Hi, Daisy. No carbs. And uh, I was able to get pretty light on those, too. Ooh. Those are $50 bicycling shoes. As Sherry Rhodes asked, what about the gummy once a day? Uh, I haven't seen that one yet. You uh, bolt on your uh, clips on here, and that way when you get on your bike, you step into them or you twist into them. Uh -huh. And that's so you could pull up as you're pushing down when you ride your bike. That says, Duncan Diet, I lost 125 pounds. Cool shoes, nice shoes, shoes. Uh, what else? Uh, Anita says, good morning, guys. The pool is looking great. Yeah, concrete's starting to dry. It's starting to cure, yeah. Remember, guys, if you like what you see, don't forget to like, comment, regulate the video, regulate to your groups, regulate to your pages, regulate, 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 or subscribe. Uh, and subscribe. Bike chain? I don't know. That thing's huge, bro. Oh, my. 
That's the biggest, heaviest, dutiest chain I've <laughs> That's got to be for a Harley, right? Yeah, right, or a motorcycle, yeah. I don't even think a timing chain's that big. Lynn Bob Johnson says, good afternoon from Sibley, IA, Iowa? That's where all the weight's coming from, too, is this thing. Yeah. Brandy Ray says, looking forward to new load of mail. I was around when you when you got your first load. <laughs> what up, St. Louis? <laughs> Yeah, uh, me too. Looking super forward to it. It's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. Karen Robinson says, garage door chain. Maybe. Maybe. It's real big. It's super heavy, too. I didn't think the garage door chain would be that heavy. Listening. Huh. All right. Two credit listening. Still intrigued. Okay. That must be for big. That makes sense. I can't wait for the mailman out uniform to come back out, lol. Uh huh? That's the craziest looking jewelry I've seen yet, bro. What the heck? It's dragons. It's a dragon. That is one big necklace. Sally Thompson says snowflakes here in in Kitchener, Ontario, Canada. Well, Kathy, Kathy, uh, Catherine Thornton says, "Well, my seafood diet and eat it, my <laughs> seafood and eat it diet isn't working." Well, looks heavy duty. That's dope. Bell. It's super heavy duty, bro. That's why this box weighs so damn much. Everything you got is all chains. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, shit, there's even more if that's not long enough. Here you go. <laughs> Ex uh, more extensions to it. There's a big chain. Karen's, uh, Karen Hill says a belly chain. Yeah, it absolutely might be a belly chain. Yeah, some say, some are saying it's a belt. Great. <laughs> Good lord. Well, I think, well, is it a belt? It looks like it is a belt, guys. K Carolyn says, eat lo a lot of cabbage. Why? I don't know. She just said, eat lot, eat lot of cabbage. Eat the sugar and cabbage. I'm trying to lighten weight here. <laughs> this box is too damn heavy. Yeah. Too heavy. Carolyn says, ooh, that would be great with my costume. Cindy says, go, Jason, go. Ooh. There we go. What is it? Oh, it's a backpack? Oh, no, it's a bag. Suede. Suede bag? That's stars on it. Oh, wait, here we go. Yeah, There's, like, stars on it all the way around. What the hell is that for? I don't know. Tarot, tarot card reading, maybe? Oh, there you go. Possibly. There was a lot of tarot cards, right? Yeah. The stars, the bag, it's all felt. It makes sense. Is that baby blanket pretty color? Nathan Lil says, hey, family. What up, Nate? Phil says, Ca uh, cabbage gives you gas. Oh, I'm good on gas, guys. <laughs> Terry Verisco sent 20 stars. I am good on gas. I don't need any help. Debbie Bre uh, Breeding says, hey, Jason and Sh Sean, it's Seth New from New <laughs> Newport, Newport News VA. Why is everyone si <laughs> That's the first name I always hear when people miss, well, when they think they know my name. is like, uh, your name's Sean, right? No, it's Seth. <laughs> wow, that's got USB and C in it. Ooh. That's cool. Yeah. That's USB cool. type C, yep. Very cool. You can take the really big chain out and it will lighten up, says Nadine Gray. Oh, that motorcycle chain for sure. Thank you. It'd probably still get to you. <laughs> well, but yeah. I promise you, even you take that chain out. Thank you, Cherry, it. for another 50 stars. We've got the colorful bracelet, 8 inch. Right, very colorful. Oop. Nice charger, nice adapter. A wrist choker for my arm. All right. 
Uh, Tammy Mike Crince asked, how is your pool coming along? Uh, it's getting there. Beautiful. And right now it's curing at the moment. They said you got to wait two days before you let the dog on it. So we have to take her outside with a, a collar. We take her. We have to walk her around it, then we close the gate so that she can start running around. That's what mom and I usually do, I think. We'll match everything. Nice bracelet. Oops, sorry, I knew that. Oh, very nice knives. Phyllis sent 250 stars and gave you cat ears just Ooh, now. Thank you, Phyllis. <laughs> Meow. Mm. <laughs> And Ray says, did you put your names on it? No, I don't think we did. I told her to. She didn't go out there, though. Tammy says, awesome. About as big as mine. Very nice. Uh, we started a star party. Ooh. I was trying to go out and put my face in it. <laughs> Get a nice face print. Mm. Nice knives. Love those knives. Uh... That's part of a tactical thing. Yeah. I uh, wonder what's for. Rose, uh, Roseanne Frederick says, hey, Jason, Hi, Jason and Seth. What up, Roseanne? <laughs> well, it has a red cross on it, so it's probably some kind of medical. Maybe, maybe, yeah. Medical tactical bag. Phil says, when can y'all swim in it? Uh, maybe in the next few weeks, according to them. Yeah. So they got to, uh, when, the, when the supervisor comes out, not the supervisor, when the uh, guy that signs off the code uh, comes out, inspects it, the inspector, he'll, as uh, soon as he inspects it, then we can do the plaster. That's all we're waiting on for the plaster. So, uh, and that means I told, thank you for reminding me, I got to go down today and I have to take a bottle of our water to the pool place and tell them, I'm going to fill the pool up with this. Is it going to turn my stuff green? Right. Everybody says, ready for Memorial Day, possibly. So that is a Chevy key, if I have ever seen one. That is a straight GM Chevy key and ignition. So you got a brand new key and ignition for your Chevy. Very cool. And it's an old school one, too. That was like the key in the uh, yellow truck. You remember the yellow truck? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, let's just pool party at Jason's. Bring it all. I bet it's salt water, right? Yeah. Mm. Uh, Ash, Alicia, Alicia McAllister says hi. What up, Alicia? Nadine asked, how long till they build your warehouse? Sooner the better. Uh, we're waiting on, uh... Code. Monday, so we had to flip the warehouse sideways, so it's not going to be the long way now, it's going to be this way. Uh, and we had to do that because it moved the warehouse closer to us, because where the water tanks had to go... That water tanks, you want, like, they don't care. Whatever. You don't have water tanks or a fire hydrant, it's fine. Because when they bring the fire truck to put your house out, they'll bring a water truck with them. Um, so this is uh, heat shrink Velcro, uh, but it's for heat, right? right? So if you have a pipe or something you want to keep cold or keep hot or not touch and get burnt, this is a heat shield. Okay. <clears throat> um, so, uh, but when you build new stuff you have to fix all the old stuff, too. So they're like, when you put the 5,000, two 5,000 gallon water tanks in, the hose has to be able to reach all the way around the warehouse on both sides, and then you have to reach around the house on both sides. So we were having trouble positioning the water tanks because they should have gone where the pool is. Uh, so we finally figured it out. We're going to try and hide them behind the rocks over there. You're still going to see the tops of them because they're eight foot, and I believe that rock slide is like seven foot. So... They're still going to be somewhat viewable or seeable, but it won't be as bad as where we had them originally. Mm. Um, but uh, because we had to spin the warehouse, now they got to redo the blueprints on the warehouse. Switchers. Expensive circuit breaker. Yeah. Our Nev says, damn I, damn, I needed that box. Also, someone was asking where they can get their mystery box. You can head on over to unboxingmystery.com or retailregulators.com there you can get yourself a mystery box yep and when the new mail comes oh look at the size of that carabiner ah. look at that one bro that'll hold your keys for days yeah oh that's a cool one too that's got a quick release on it yeah or oh it doesn't close either so as soon as you let it go it locks it looks back into place yeah it locks into place until you spin it that, that one's killer that's for like rock climbing. Yeah. Come null. 
The name is Kamnal. Um, yeah, so, uh, and there's going to be a plethora of boxes. So it's not going to be like the last few we got where I was forcing everybody to have us open them and then wait. I would appreciate you guys buying them to open, uh, but you're not going to be forced to uh, because we got to crank some out, seriously, because that's a big... They're charging me $25,000 for that truck. Yeesh. Susan Rail says, Rail says, how are you from Indiana? Whoop. That's Sally says, smaller one. Yeah. Sally says, unboxingmystery.com has the best mystery boxes around, bar none. Bar none. <laughs> I've seen some of the crap people have gotten in the past from other places. It's scary. Well, Deborah Bishop, T- uh, Tisha Hill says, I finally, I finally caught a live after two and a half days. <laughs> Candy Coach Austin says, love the family and baby girl Lucy. Oh, it's for a guitar. That's oh. parts for a guitar. Oh, okay. It's all guitar parts. Oh, yeah, the ones that hold the strings and all that. Focus one, BR7. Is that the type of guitar it goes to? No, I think that's just because that's universal. That could go on any guitar. Just mm. in case you want purple or uh, gold parts. All right. Tisha Hill says, it's hot here in Bakersfield, California. Ooh, it's not bad today. It yeah. is not bad today. It was cloudy for the mo- for a large part of it. Beth says, I restarted my phone. I got a notification. Nice. Well, there's a hint, everybody. Restart your phone or reload Facebook. Make sure you have your uh, make sure you have your passwords if you try and reload Facebook, though. Very like marble bottom and then uh Yeah, jungle leaf top. Kind of cool looking. Alright, hold on. I'm trying to get to see the other one. Alrighty. Interesting. Joyce Kep, uh, Kel, uh, Kleppinger says, hello, guys. What up, Joyce? 18-inch. This is Lucy's size right here. She can't get her mouth on it <laughs> when it's on her neck. Then she tries to chew on it, too. Like, she, we, she did that the other day and tried to chew on it. Phil so says, as hot as all Hades here already. Nice golden diamonds. Very, very nice. Nice artwork. Jessica Cruz says, hey, you guys. Mom went to get waxed. Yes. Mom went to get waxed. She said she she was going to take me and have them wax my back. Oh, boy. And I said, that's fine, but you got to videotape it on live. Because that Uh, seems like a spectacle to watch. Oh, (laughs) yeah. Where is she today? Get uh, that mom's getting her legs waxed. I think. How's that for a hairy back right there, huh? That would be a good wax job, right? There. <laughs> uh huh. I usually make mom shave it when she complains about it. <laughs> Mary B. No says ninety degrees here. Christy, uh, Christy Johnson says low ouch waxing. Yeah, those are the good ones right there. Those go on the side of your truck. On the side of your trailer. Yeah. <laughs> Those are cool. Susan says, it's 56 degrees and sunny in Indiana. Cheryl Fultz says, I tried waxing once. Never again. Ouch. Remember, guys, if you like what you see, don't forget to like, comment, regulate the video, regulate to your groups, regulate to your pages, regulate, 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 and subscribe. Remember, regulate means to share. Well, that's a little kid jacket. Maybe. It looks like a dog jacket. It is a dog jacket. Lucy, come here. That is a dog jacket. Come here, Bubba. And it's got a furry collar and everything, and you can cinch it up around the neck, and it's the full harness, too. Yeah. It was that like is a the full dog jacket harness. For one of those very cold days. My world, my rules. That is super nice, guys. It's all furry. Patty Cohen says, my nephew had me wax his back. <laughs> I let Annalisa bought the little machine in the bathroom and she tried my back one time, but she didn't do it right. She like waxed my skin and then like just her digging her fingernail in, trying to get the tip of it pried up. You did it wrong. Just, you know what I mean? Like <laughs> if you're going to do it, put something down like a little piece of paper and then wax over the paper. That way you can just pull the paper up and you could rip from that angle. 
rather than trying to dig under my skin do, with your fingernails. Dad, get do you have experience wax. with waxing people's back? <laughs> uh huh. Oh, which is right there. That would be a good video, season 18. Yeah, I agree. Because I'm going to scream. You know I am. I'm going to scream. Oh, hey, what's up? Speaking of whom. Uh, Hi, Lucy. Hi. I didn't, I didn't hear you. I did the waxing just fine. Just so you know. <laughs> what's it? No, you're waxing. Uh, spe- speaking of, speaking of <laughs> mom. Who <laughs> oh, did the baby? Uh, Shirley says you should buy. You can buy strips of paper that are waxed already, and you can do Not what exactly. Not the kind of hair he's got, people. All right, we need heavy duty stuff. We have gamer duvet set. I remember when I tried to describe to someone what the sheets were at the swap meet on Thursday. I said it's a duvet set. He was like, "Eh, yeah." I'm like, it, "I just screw. It's a bed sheet set." He's like, "Oh, okay." I'm like. She's stealth. Hello, queen from Maine. The queen is back. <laughs> I am stealth. Sandra Br- uh, Ronner says, Hi, Annalise and Seth are. Hello, C. Oh, it's new shavers. Yeah. <laughs> Just in case your shavers go bad. Uh-huh. Just in case you go to the waxing salon and chicken out. Oh, I didn't chicken out. Carly and Geek says, Nice to see Lucy happy. Well, those are extensions for the big hula hoop that you saw the other day. Ah. <laughs> Too bad there wasn't a hula hoop in this box. Right. Atisha says she snuck in on you guys, lol. And this says evil energy. Evil energy. Irena Simus Simus Adams says, hello, Warner, Michigan. Cheryl Fultz says shavers for Jason's back. I tried that too. I tried it all. Well, Juanita Mendez. Woo. Lucy. What the heck? I have no idea. Huh. Uh, Very pretty. <laughs> water heater, maybe? Something for your water heater? In, out, in, out, return. I need to look that up. That that looks very expensive. Camping stove. Yeah. Sally says, wow, this box keeps going. Yeah. I know. What in the world? We need to look that up because that might be the creme de la creme right there. So we'll look that up after the video. Uh, she said yank the chain out because it weighed too much. I agreed. And let's see some <laughs> dice. All righty. We are at 27.50. We're about to hit 28 minutes. All right, here you go. All right, guys, if you share it to your page and you comment, 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 come back in two, three hours, watch the video again, and see if you left a comment on this time. If you did, you get to pick a free item under $100 on the website. 406. Four minutes and six seconds is your hot time, guys. Come on back and check to see who left a comment on four minutes and six seconds. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, we'll see you shortly.